Hi, welcome to Moonfax. Today I'm going to be drawing this scarab guy. I don't usually draw clothes in my artwork, so it was pretty fun to design a costume for this character. With that being said, please enjoy watching this video. This piece doesn't really have any meaning or message, it's just kind of fun to look at, I hope. When I was sketching this piece out, I was debating attaching the legs to a headdress versus actually connecting them into the character's skull. I think it would have been a lot cooler if I had made the legs a part of their body, but I wouldn't have gotten the practice in for the clothes. In this character's clothes, we're li literally just drawing a draping cloth. I, it's like super simple, so I need to work on drawing a lot of different variations of clothes, but clothes usually aren't the main focus of my artwork, so I need to get a bit creative in convincing myself that it, it's worth it to draw the clothes. I find drawing faces at this small of a scale is a bit difficult, but if I use a full-sized sheet of paper for each artwork that I did, I would need a lot more money to pay for all the supplies. The way I do it now is I take a regular sized sheet and then I cut it into four pieces, and that way I have I can stretch one piece of paper for four whole videos and besides it's not really like it's not going into a gallery and most anyone who views it is going to be viewing it on a small screen or maybe a computer but because the intended viewing experience is so scaled down I don't really see the point in putting the time and effort into creating a big grand piece for every single video when I'm just going to lose all the details anyway.
skin differently today because I want to expand to, into different tones rather than going the easy way and just depending on a single colored pencil for the skin base. What I've done is I've gone in with a peach color over most of the skin area except for the bright highlights and then on top of that I layered a sienna brown. Now I can continue my normal process of coloring skin with any shade of blue, red, and yellow. I think the lighting in my artwork usually turns out okay, but it's never anything noteworthy. In my sketchbook, I've been trying to make time to study the ways light can fall on a face, but between my personal life and the online content I create, it keeps getting pushed out. At this point, I can tell that I'm really liking the way the skin is turning out, which was encouragement that I really needed because lately I feel like my artwork has been super mid and I'm sure everyone's familiar with the struggle of continuing to make art while you're unmot unmotivated and unhappy with what you're making. This wasn't in my plan, but there are too many bright colors that were going on, so to fix it, I did a layer of blue over the clothes, and after I burnished it, the work I had already done underneath blended in a really pretty way with the blue on top. Now that I'm starting to wrap up the artwork, I, I can't help but think it would be interesting to write this guy into a story, and I think the world building for that story would be really fun to make up. So if any of my viewers are into writing, leave something for me in the comments and I'll enjoy reading your work while you enjoy watching mine. Anyways, thank you for being here and supporting my channel.